With this heat, you got to be, you got to take every precaution. Exactly. And I've got a lot of construction going on where I live. Mm. Beside my house, behind my house, on the other side of the house, everywhere. There's always crews out there. No one was out there yesterday. Oh, wow. So okay. that was encouraging. It's like, okay, these companies are kind of taking into consideration mm -hmm. that worker safety is really important. And I would say today, another day, if you work outside, maybe plan ahead to work remotely if that's an option or maybe just take another breather today because it is going to be another dangerously hot one out there as we're getting our day started looking over the skyline here in downtown Indy. The sky is clear, but we've certainly got some haze out there as we get our Wednesday underway. We're at 78 degrees right now, but that dew point temperature is certainly on the high end already at 72. And as we plug that up, dew point temperature into our muggy meter over the next 12 hours. We're not really going to find much relief from that moisture content to the air today. We're still going to be in that miserable category. Again, keep in mind that uh, miserable line is pretty much anything 70 or above. And with those dew points in the low 70s, we're once again going to really feel that air out there again today. The sky is clear, though, for your morning rush. We're going to start temps off in the upper 70s. Once the sun does come up during the 6 o'clock hour, we'll start to see those temperatures rising. So forecast for today, 9 o'clock in the morning, up to 82 already approaching 90 by one and then eventually we are back into the mid 90s for highs today around 96 here in Indy 97 up in Lafayette 96 over in Greencastle temperatures that are very similar to where they were yesterday so pretty much again a copy and paste forecast from yesterday into today but we're talking about the difference between the air temperature and that dew point and how that comes into play with the heat index essentially we've got the air around us the ambient air that's actually measured in the shade. We take that number and we take the dew point that we just talked about with our muggy meter. And that equation spits out that heat index, which once again today is going to be dangerously high up to 103 here in the Indy Metro, 102 in Kokomo, 105 in Terre Haute, and some weather models predicting an upwards of 108 for your peak heat index for later today. So one of those days if you can avoid being outside for extended amounts of time. Uh, that's going to be the case for today. We head into the evening tonight. Sunset around 915. We are still going to be pushing that 90 degree mark close to sunset today, falling back to 84 by 10 p.m. But here we go with some changes. You're ready for this as we get into our Thursday. Watch what's going to happen. A cold front setting up to our northwest. And while this is not going to completely pass through on Thursday, we're going to start that transition into some more comfortable air eventually. Here we go Thursday early in the morning. This will spark perhaps a stray shower. Around 24 hours from now, Thursday morning, not going to rule out that potential. That boundary will essentially stall out over central Indiana on Thursday, and that's still going to allow for those temperatures to recover back into the mid 90s under a mostly sunny sky Thursday afternoon. Here's when that boundary actually is going to come through, and it could potentially fire off some strong to severe storms during the overnight Thursday into early Friday morning. This is around midnight, early Friday. This boundary will then work its way in. Storms will start to initiate here. This is 2 o'clock in the morning while most of us are sleeping, so this is why we need to kind of think ahead here and stay weather aware in case we do get some uh, severe warnings out of this. We're going to keep storms going through the first part of the day, early Friday, but most of this is going to be pushing south as we get into our Friday 7 a.m. sunrise and then more dry time. Still going to be hot on Friday, but that cold front is going to be a game changer as far as the moisture in the atmosphere and how that muggy meter is going to play out. So we are still going to be in that miserable category both today and tomorrow, but already by Friday you're going to start to see that number dropping and then as we get into the weekend, Dew points in the 40s. It's going to feel like a completely different season out there for this weekend. And as far as temperatures go, we're back closer to that seasonal average 81 and sunny on Saturday. We've got 84 in sunshine for Father's Day. And enjoy that while it lasts because we're going to start to heat things back up as that humidity builds on Monday into Tuesday.